What's up, Pride Nation? Back at you with another one today. This is Noble Sports Entertainment. If you have not subscribed yet to this channel, then what are you waiting for? Because on this channel, we talk sports, period. Also, make sure you hit that subscription button. And when you hit that subscribe button, also, don't forget to hit the bell and click on all that you'll get all uploads and notifications from Noble Sports Entertainment. All right, guys, we got some breaking news out of Detroit today. We kind of saw this coming. The writing was on the wall with Tej Tabor and his uh, growth and development in Detroit. And it's kind of sad, man, because this thing did not pan out the way Bob Quinn wanted it to pan out. He was one of the guys a couple seasons ago that Bob Quinn drafted and really was high on this guy and thought that ultimately he would become a starter alongside Darius Slay. But it just didn't work out, man. It just didn't pan out. We talked about him on a round table uh, the other day. And uh, just said that this guy was possibly going to be on the bubble. We did not see him none the preseason because he was hurt and going through an injury. And uh, as soon as he got cleared to uh, be able to get back out on the field, the Detroit Lions decide to cut him. Um, man, wishing T's Tabor nothing but the best. But we knew when the Detroit Lions drafted Amani Awarie that they was going to try to develop a new corner in Detroit because Tease has not worked out. Now, there's many of us that said that also Tease probably would have been better suited being a safety and playing a safety position. So we don't know uh, what team is going to give Tease Tabor that ultimate, that try. Maybe they may try him at safety. Uh, maybe he may find his way out of the league. We just don't know. But the Detroit Lions on, the, on today decided to part ways with Tease Tabor. And I know it's because you got guys like Rashawn Melvin, Justin Coleman, all of these guys coming over and uh, all these guys who are doing really, really well um, in the uh, in the preseason and not only the preseason, the training camp. Now, in the training camp, Tease Tabor was balling out and he was playing good. But I just think this, guys, I think that Tease Tabor time just ran up in Detroit. Detroit has been getting rid of a lot of old pieces on their team. And we know that that is evident by guys like Theo Riddick and also releasing Zach Zinner. So now the Detroit Lions decide to part ways with Tej Tabor. So that definitely means that Amani Warrior is probably going to be in a rotation. He's not going to be a starter, but it looks like Rashawn Melvin probably will end up being a starter alongside Darius Slay. But uh, Tej Tabor will not be backing these guys up. So it's going to be interesting to see how this thing plays out, man, because the Lions – cut Tease Tabor. He was the first person to go. Soon as he came off of his injury, Tease Tabor was the first person to go. And we just got through talking about Tease Tabor and saying that he probably can be one of those guys that the Lions end up releasing unless they find grace and have grace for him. And I guess his grace in his time in Detroit ran out. So, all right, guys, make sure you subscribe to Noble Sports Entertainment on this channel. We talk sports, period. And I'll be back to you soon with another video. I'm out of here. Peace. I can't eat my heart.